Aaron Boone and the manager's report brought to you by Geico. Aaron, I know you've continually voiced your confidence in this team and their ability to get back on track, but is there a, an element of relief after snapping that five-game losing streak? Um, yeah, definitely feels, look, you know, one of the best things about, um, you know, being a ball player or a manager or a coach is you pour so much into the job and, and the everyday that, you know, at the end of the day, it's about shaking hands and being a part of something that a lot of people had a hand in. And I felt that way tonight. So it's definitely nice to get it going, um, you know, against obviously a tough opponent and a, and a really tough pitcher on the mound for them in, in Morton, who I thought threw the ball really well today. Um, but a lot of guys, you know, even though we didn't break it open or, or you know, there, there were a lot of really good things that happened tonight, obviously on the mound, starting with uh, J-Mo. Um, but, you know, there were some competitive things that happened that allowed us to win a well-played ball game, and that's nice. When you say competitive things that have happened, what specifically stands out to you as a step in the right direction? You know, I just thought, I thought we had some really good kind of winning at bats there in the eighth inning to grab the lead. Um, I thought we were, I thought, especially as the game wore on, I thought there were some real stronger at bats against Morton, who I thought was on his game tonight. Um, you know, we made we made some plays in the field. You know, every pitcher that came in, and, and of course, Jamo, I thought made a lot of really good pitches in some big spots. You know, we got out of a couple jams. Um, so just you know, it was a good effort and a good step, and, and hopefully, uh, you know, something that we can start to build on. What impressed you about Tyone? I thought the stuff was really good again, and maybe ticked up again. Um, you know. Thought he worked the top of the zone with his fastball. We saw some 93, 4, 5 consistently. Um, I thought he mixed in his slider really well tonight, shaped some good, really good curveballs, um, was fairly pitch efficient. You know, after, you know, a pitch count, I think, got up on him a little bit in the third and maybe fourth, and then came out and had a really strong inning there. Uh, actually, it might have been in the fourth where he was really efficient. Uh, and, and I thought, just thought, pitched really well for five innings, uh, you know, against a, a good hitting team. Bruce Beck, please unmute. Aaron, is a grinded out win even more meaningful? Um, well, I'll take a blowout, too. <laughs> uh, look, it, it's obviously been a tough week for us, a long week for us, but, um, you know, to be able to, you know, Win a tough, tough game, and like you said, a grinded out game. I think there is a lot of satisfaction in that. In that, a lot of people in that room tonight, in varying ways, had had a hand in that victory, and and that was that was good to see. No runs, four innings, two hits, five Ks from your bullpen. Just overall, the the, the contributions from a lot of guys tonight. What did that mean? Yeah, it was big. Um, you know, you know, Litke came in and in, in a tough spot there. You know, we we threw him right into. You know the the uh, the Freeman and on through the middle of their order uh, on through Sandoval. I thought he did a good job with that. Lost Sandoval for the leadoff walk, and then Greeny came in and and pitched well, and 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 Wilson came in and got a huge out of Freeman there with the bases loaded. You know, low after you know hitting the first batter with a with a pitch. I thought settled in and had a real efficient inning, and then even though they took some good at bats, I thought off Chappie. I thought he threw the ball really well to finish it off for us. Dave Lennon, please unmute. Hey, I'm with Tyone. Like you mentioned, a number of his pitches were sharp, and his curveball was too. And even in the fifth, he threw a nice one as, as he was his last inning there. Um, he was at 80 pitches. I mean, is this a situation where I know all pitch counts are always different, but do you anticipate him building on that moving forward? No, I would have. I would have gone more with him tonight. Um, you know, he's he's built up to where I, I feel good about him getting into the 90s, even probably 100 pitches at this point. So, And and the way that his pitches are now and the way he was in kind of command tonight, you, I mean, does the confidence in him increase with that? I mean, I know you've always had faith that he would go out there and pitch well, but an outing like this may tend to add another level to it maybe. Yeah. I, not I, I, I've loved what I've seen, frankly. I, I mean, really, the whole way. I, I know – 
you know, it's been a talking point, especially as we've gone through this, where we've struggled to score some runs. But I, I really feel like this is kind of what we've been seeing, and it's kind of been building a little bit more and more each time. And I'm I'm pretty pleased with where he's at in 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 his build up and his progress.